Hello everyone, I am Dan, this is Ethan, and are we going to see your serious side today? I think so, why not? Sweet. <laughs> You've been involved with Teenage Cancer Trust for a while now. How did you get involved and what have you been involved with so far? So I was actually approached during COVID, or just before COVID struck, to run the London Marathon. I got a ballot place through the, the charity, which is absolutely amazing. And it was obviously a new challenge to myself. I'd never run a marathon before. I'd just gone through a transformation. I thought, what better charity to do it for? Seeing as my mum's had cancer as well, it's nice to see the help that they do with young people. And I thought, what better cause to do it for? So what made you want to get involved and what made you want to step up into the icon position? I feel like with our audience, we have a lot of young people that watch us, have grown up with us. And I think bringing awareness to not just cancer affecting people older in life, but also young people, bringing awareness to that is important. What will you be doing as part of your year as Teenage Cancer Trust Icon? So it is an absolute honour to be welcomed on board as a Teenage Cancer Trust Icon. They put on plenty of incredible events throughout the year. Uh, I should be attending some of those, which will be a lot of fun. Uh, bringing awareness to the charity like I just mentioned, and of course, playing very well in the charity match and trying to score the winning goal. <laughs> what would you say to any fans that are worried that they might have cancer? I think it's important to go and get it checked out, get involved with your local GP, and of course, Teenage Cancer Trust website has a load of good sources of information on there, so make sure to go and check it all out. Finally, who do you think is going to win the charity match? Oh, this is a big one. See, last year's match was so good. An 8-7. I think the YouTube All-Stars are going to be up for it. So I think it's going to be another tight game. But I just believe in the sidemen. Of course I'm going to back ourselves. We're going to win again. And especially it being at my home stadium, I'm even more motivated. <laughs>